Alright guys, just in this little video we're just going to talk a wee bit just on basically activating the muscles and just getting the most out of, out of your workouts and everything you do basically. Um, a couple of the online programs I've done, you know, where you be kind of training kind of better guys just online and all that sort of stuff just to learn. And a common thing is like a morning routine, 5-10 minutes in the first thing every morning, just kind of get the muscles going and basically get them activated. A lot of the times, like the majority of people just want to look better, but if they were to activate the muscles and get more out of it, they'd get a better, kind of more toned look. And as well for people in sports and that, they want to get more obviously out of the muscles to run and jump and all that sort of stuff. Um, it's good for them as well, okay? So the first exercise we're going to do is just squat the stand, which is one we do in class for warm up, and it's a really good one to just, especially first thing in the morning when you're a bit stiff, just to loosen out the hamstrings and the groins, hips, all that sort of crack, okay? So we'll just start off here. So you basically you just want, you're keeping your fingers underneath your toes, and all, you keep the heels on the ground the whole time, alright? So you're just here, keep the legs straight, so get a bit of a stretch the hamstrings, and you're sitting the hips right down, back straight, looking up, pull up over three, and then you're coming right up, head into the ground between these for three, and you're just doing three seconds in each one. So you can see the hips are right down, and then bring them right up. And you just want to keep that going, just right down, and then right up, okay? Just three seconds on each one, and uh, just sit nice and deep and come right up. So you want to do about 10 reps all together, keep the feet flat. You see a lot of people are coming up and the heels on the ground. You want to keep the feet flat, or the heels up, sorry. You want to keep everything flat. And just you'll find as you go, um, you'll increase your range as you go, all right? The more reps you do. So you want to be doing a good 10, 15 a.m. every morning, and then increase as you go, all right? So the next one then is just one leg squats. So you want to do eight reps on each leg. So just for now, I'm just going to do three, just to kind of show just for time's sake. So you've one leg out straight, and you're sitting the hips back and down. And you want to sit, just find your range, okay? And just whatever, whatever depth you can get there. So just use your foot then for a bit of balance. And then just sit nice and deep into it and just back up, okay? And just tap the foot on the ground if you need that. Sit nice and deep and back up, okay? So just do three, well, eight on three, you want to do eight, eight to ten, okay? The first one or two can be tricky just to get your balance, kind of get in the swing of it. But you just, whoop, just want to get the other one and just sit nice and deep, alright? So just do one more, and make up for that one, and then back up, alright? So you want to do eight then each side, and then we're lateral lunges, okay? So it's a good one to stretch out the grind and also get the, the glutes and all over as well. So the feet hip width apart, big step out to the side and sit deep into it. So you get a good stretch to the grind. And then this is where you're pushing off, back to start. Right across, sit deep and push off. Keep this leg straight, foot on the ground, don't be falling in like a lot of people do in class. But you have to just kind of keep them right. You just want to sit deep, keep the leg straight and foot flat. Just go six each side, just over and back, okay? So now that's the last one of our push-ups. Okay, so on uh, the, the hypertrophy max where everyone kind of was voting now for that competition, uh, these guys were big on uh, not lifting mad heavy, but activating the muscle more and squeezing the muscle as much as possible. And that's why we're seeing guys in their 40s and 50s can still lift heavy and be in good shape, whereas the guys that kept lifting heavy bigger, 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 now their shoulders, everything's done and they're not fit to do anything, they're just injured all the time. Okay, so this is a good point. If you're doing press-ups, we're going to do a 30 second hold here, and the same thing when you're doing like a bench press. Anytime you're pushing up in your mind, you're trying to squeeze your hands together, you're pushing against the steel, and it helps to work the, the chest a lot better, okay? So we're doing the same thing here on the press ups. So I'm just going to hold it, and I'm going to squeeze my hands tight together, okay? So I'm just here, and you just want to squeeze the hands tight together. So you want to be doing this 30 seconds, I'm just going to do it 15, and really squeeze them as best you can. And just push the last five then, and just squeeze as tight as you can, just push the hands together. Okay, so that's just 15 seconds, you want to go about 30, um, and you just want to you'll feel that very good right across the chest. Okay, so that's a good one to be doing. All right, the next thing we're on to our Bulgarian split squats, so we just come over to the bench here. Okay, so we're doing left leg Bulgarian split squats, and then uh, Spider Man one straight after. So find here. I'm just going to step out on my left leg, okay, and then just throw my right foot back on the bench. Okay, move a wee bit to the side there, so we'll just move a bit. Okay, you want to make sure your toe is past your knee, okay? And then I'm sitting nice and deep to where my hamstrings part out of the ground, okay? I'm holding this now, I'm going 25 seconds, 
I'm going to hold it for 20, the last five, I'm going to do mini weak pulses, okay? So back straight, head up, my hamstrings parallel to the floor, foot's flat, and I'm just holding it there. So we're going to squeeze the legs well, just try and squeeze the muscles to get a bit more out of it. So last five, and then I'm doing wee mini pulses then for the last five seconds on it, and I'm just dragging the heel into the ground, and that's 25 seconds, okay? Then from there, I'm going straight into the spiral hand lunges, I'm just doing six reps, so with the feet tight together, I want this foot flat and open wide. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So you've got a great stretch there in the grind as well, and that's a good movement, okay? So then you're just up, and then also you're just going to do the same on the right leg. So you do your 25 seconds per year in split squat, and then six reps, okay? So uh, definitely try and give this a good run. Like every guys, you just have to do a bit of training now and see how you get on. Give it a good run of like 14, 21 days, two to three weeks. Do it every morning. Just set your arm, get your ass out of bed a couple of minutes earlier, and you'll be okay, alright? So uh, just let me know your thoughts, let me know what you think, and thanks for watching. Chat video.